Are you guys ready for your headliner? Put your hands together, make some noise for the one, the only, Jeff Garcia! <laughs> fucking that guy was fucking hilarious. He's fat as fuck. All there is out there, all there is back there is tits. Lola's tits. Chris's tits. There's like mammograms going on back there. You guys good? How you doing? It's funny. There's a whole bunch of security outside because they haven't seen this many Mexicans in that spectrum. <laughs> Fucking ice is outside. <laughs> Border patrol's kicking it. I, I, I fucking, I, when I grew up, we were scared to cross the 57. <laughs> 57 freeway, fuck yeah, right? No, the 57, <laughs> what are you doing? 57, bro. <laughs> we have cousins that came over here, huh? In Orange County. Fuck, it's nice out there. <laughs> the bathrooms are all clean. There's no homeless. But, you know, you know Mexicans, we're responsible for all the, the white people that moved this far, right? You didn't know that? Check this out, like, oh, back in like the 1900s, early 1900s and shit. <laughs> we grew up in East LA, right? And white people were all, they're all in East LA. Let's move to Montebello. <laughs> then we move there. They're like, fuck, we need to move to West Covina. <laughs> then we move there. You know, what's the, uh, shit, we need to go to Anaheim. <laughs> and then we move there. In 20 years, white people are going to move, live in Mexico. <laughs> We're going to have to sneak back over to get jobs. <laughs> you know, Asian cat, what's up, man? What kind of Asian are you, man? What do you think I am? I'm not hitting at you at a club. What the fuck? What do you think I am? I have no idea, bro. Vietnamese. Okay, yeah, we had a problem with you for a minute. <laughs> Thank God my dad didn't come. Shit, Charlie's here. No, his name's Vince. Relax, dad. Mm -mm. <laughs> What's your name? <laughs> Who's your daddy? Who's your dad? <laughs> you hear that old couple back there? Hey, man, is he rich like me? I don't give a shit. I love old, I, I love old people in general. Because they're the only ones that don't have to like actually like participate in all this bullshit. Where you, don't have, you can't say things. Talk to an old white guy. Go to the park. Find an old white man, bro. Find an old white man that and his wife is all old and he's hating life. Been married her forever and shit. She's feeding pigeons. Fucking God, send a thunderbolt to my throat. You suck, Victor. They say it the way it is, right? Everybody should be able to say it the way it is. I have no problem with Asian people, but my dad does. He even, they chased me around for years in the jungle, son. I can't stand Hyundai's. What's your name, brother? What? Kevin. I was right, huh? Wasn't I close to right? What's your real name, fucker? Come on, man. Come on, your, your driver's license says, No, I'm Kevin. Fucking Asian. I know you're, no, I don't have no complaint. I don't hate nobody. I like immigration. I do, because you think about it. The cure for cancer is hiding in a boat coming from Indonesia. You know what I'm saying? It's, it's like he's there. I killed cancer. How'd you get here? Boat, bottom. Black people, I seen you walking in, so I know you're here. 
You don't give a fuck about curing cancer. Man, all I give a fuck about is blunt rap. <laughs> Can I have another stool? Is there an employee that listening to me right now? Can I have another stool? Yeah, stool. Yeah, can I get that? Thank you, sweetheart. What's your name? What's your name? Natalie. That's an awesome name. That's my niece's name. My sister's here. Where you at, Liz? No, there she is right there. I have one sister. Weird, huh? She married a white man. Not, no, she has a new husband, a way better one. He's Mexican as fuck. We call him Widow from the Ghetto. But she married a white guy, and she has two daughters from the white guy, and one of them's white as fuck, white as fuck, and the other one looks like, like Pocahontas, like dark, with thick-ass fucking beaner hair and shit. So she asked me to babysit one day, and then like she, they ratted me out, because I put one, the Pocahontas one, and I had it on video. I have it on video if you check my Instagram. I put the Pocahontas one on one side of the room, and I put the white-looking one, and I made the white-looking one yell, build a wall. <laughs> you didn't like that one or what? <laughs> Fucking judgers at my show and shit. Thank you so much. Give it up for Guy Ferrari. He showed up. And Divers, hookers, and dashes. I don't know what the fuck he hosts. It's a fucking fun show. I'm having fun with you guys already. Don't worry, it ain't over. I'm getting comfortable. Fucking John Lovitz left his fucking piano here and shit. Because he can't get white people to show up after 9 o'clock. That's why they hired us, right? Because Mexicans are like, what? 12.30, we'll be there, eh? White guys on no, no, Taylor has soccer tomorrow. <laughs> Fucking white people, they do that shit, huh? You white or what? You look white as hell. <laughs> white people never hang out like... <laughs> I have white friends. I make money, so I have white friends. <laughs> you would trip out on their fucking show. Oh, my God, 9.30. Is everybody tired? I'm like, fuck, I got a keg in the car. What? <laughs> Leaving Irvine, I'm going to Santa Ana. <laughs> Is that where you're from? Or, uh, fuck, it's Santa Ana. I love that neighborhood. It's perfect for robbing people. <laughs> it is, because it's surrounded by white neighborhoods. There's a pocket of, fuck, like Tijuana, like put right in the middle of Beverly Hills. You're driving, we should move here. It's not good. Give me your money, puto. What the fuck? I was in a nice neighborhood right now. Trip <laughs> out on Santa Ana. It's like fucking Mexico there, huh? Surrounded by mansions. If you live there, if you live around Santa Ana, you have no problem finding a nanny. You didn't get that one? If you don't get it, raise your hand. I'll stop. <laughs> I got time, man. I'm so fucking bored. I gained a lot of weight. Look how fucking fat I am. I fucking feel fat as fuck. You know what sucks is fucking bathrooms. When you buy a house, they have like mirrors out of the shower. I want to break that shit. I get out. Ah. Uh, I'm single. I pick up on a chick. Oh, you want to hang out? No, I wouldn't want to hang out with this either. <laughs> Got out of the shower. Oh, I don't even want to masturbate when I look in the mirror. I'm like, I wouldn't hit that. <laughs> I know you, let, you thought the last guy was funny. I'm fucking kick ass, don't I? <laughs> I've been doing this since I was a child. <laughs> I was a child, yeah. <laughs> I know, I'm okay, above average. I just trip out because we're in Irvine. I, mean, I don't get hired in white neighborhoods. I Where you going? Fresno. All right. They sent me an email. Fresno, San Jose, Irvine. All right. What was the last one? I'm fucking cops out here. They shoot everything brown. Some cop shot the dirt last night. What, uh, brown. It's brown, sir. It was threatening. <laughs> <laughs> Fucking trash.
traffic. I, I was in traffic today. I left at 8. The fuck, 8 traffic? Why is there traffic at 8? Where are you going? And everybody looked at me the same place you are. You get that? Okay, some people got that. Okay, moving on. I don't know if you know my style, but I pretty much make it up as I go along. You know why? Because I want it to be your personal show. Like, this can never happen again. Never. When are we going to find a Vietnamese guy named fucking Kevin next time? You can find me every week at CarMax. Uh, on the real man, I'm gonna tell you a little secret. Like we don't say it out loud because it's rude, but Mexicans we don't like Asians. I'll tell you why. Cause in high school you fucked up the curve. I miss one question and get an F. Cause you get 128 percent on a test. Walk up to you. How do you get 128 percent on a test? I finished so early. I make up my own question. And then I answer it. Then I correct it. I'm my own teacher, you a bitch. Our car insurance went up because we live by Alhambra. Are you gonna drive by Alhambra? Yeah, I might, yeah, a couple of I have $400. Stay in Almani, it's 80 bucks. But if you drive by Alhambra, because you guys don't even give a fuck when you drive, huh? No, don't give to a fuck. You didn't get that? Are you not enjoying this show? Every time I, if you don't laugh, I'm not happy, all right? It's my job to make you laugh, all right? This ain't Netflix, girl. I'm really here. <laughs> now I know I'm good at this. You can laugh, it's okay. I know. <laughs> you done? What do you do for a living, Kev? What? You're a teacher? You're not a driving teacher, are you? <laughs> First lesson you have to learn. When they turn it yellow, push gas as hard as you can. You get to where you got to go. Time is money. Mm. <laughs> Your high school teacher? You really? What, what class? What? Video production. Video production. <laughs> so when you crash your car, <laughs> you will take a video <laughs> to prove they're the asshole. <laughs> I'm sorry, sometimes they make me laugh too. <laughs> <laughs> fucking teachers, you guys are the most unappreciated people on the fucking planet, man. That should be like a draft, like an NFL draft to be a teacher. You should be paid millions. Fucking. Thank you, man. Oh, man, I got you, man. You know what's funny? I got to tell you something, bro, and I'm, I, I'm sure I'm going to get me too after this goes on YouTube. <laughs> when I hear about a male teacher having sex with a young student, I get really mad. When I hear about a male student fucking their teacher, I'm like, fuck yeah, dude. <laughs> That's some pimp shit. <laughs> Fuck yeah. You hit that? You hit that? Fuck yeah. <laughs> True story, my son. Like, uh, he's going to hate when I say this. This is, is going to be on YouTube, and you guys are all going to be in it. My son talked these girls in because he's underage. Like, he was like a, a sophomore in high school. He's 21 now. But he talked these girls into sending him like nude pictures. So the police officer, because I lived in a white neighborhood, it's called Laverne, <laughs> Mumsy. 
It's like Irvine without the niceness. <laughs> Fucking, he talked these girls into sending him pictures of her boobs and shit. And like, I was torn like crazy. Because as a parent, I'm like, you know what the fuck is wrong with you? As a fucking dad, like, you know, with a son, I'm like, fuck yeah, bro. You're the man, son. I didn't kiss a girl till I was 12. You're, you're sending you tit shots? Fuck. My ex-wife there, she hates me. Are you proof of this? I'm like, no. <laughs> fucking A, man. I don't know how to be a dad. What the fuck? You know what I get mad at is kids that don't like their dads or their moms. You know what I'm saying? I get mad at that. This, you, fucking, you shoot out with the umbilical cord. There's no pamphlet attached. What the fuck we're doing? You know what I mean? Like, you don't know what the fuck you're doing. It's a like fucking person. And they're looking at you. I'm hungry. Well, me too. And I'm a man. That means I'm a child. <laughs> Women are way smarter than us. They fucking so smart. Women fucking blow us brain-wise. Look at my fucking, my, my sister. She's married to this dude. He'll do anything for him. What the fuck, dude? You could do so much better. And he looks at me and goes, no, I love her. I'm, she's my queen. I mean, the fuck, you have that written down? <laughs> fucking awesome dude. Does everything for her. Bought her a new car. How long ago did you buy her that car, bro? For her birthday, yeah. Uh. See? That's what I'm trying to say. We're stupid. <laughs> Men are fucking dumb as... F we're fucking dumb as doornails. This should have been a woman president in 1940. I'm not voting for her, but it should have been. I got a homeboy. This is no lie. He's a private investigator. I'm like, what do you private investigate? Like, Most of my money comes from guys, um, from women that suspect their men cheating. I'm all, would you ever have take cases where the woman's cheating? I don't take those. I'm like, why? He's all, because you can't catch them. They're too fucking smart. <laughs> He's all, I was waiting in a fucking, the girl worked in the mall at Kay's Jewelers. I'm waiting and I see her car. And I'm waiting until like 1230. The mall closes at 10. <laughs> she walks out and gets in her car and goes home. What well, the fuck was she at two and a half hours? It took, her, it took him three months to find catch her. You know, dudes, we're fucking stupid. <laughs> you want know, fucking this Motel 6? <laughs> fucking dumbasses we are. Shit, my taxes? I owe so much tax money. Uh, yeah, Uncle Samuel. Man, fuck you, dick. <laughs> I just paid my first pay, and it was $46,000 I had to pay for back. Yeah, I know, right? That's a fucking, at least a fucking Nissan Ultra. <laughs> or Maxima, or whatever the fuck they're called. <laughs> you know what's funny? I pay so much tax money, I, when I get pulled over for running a red light, I but no, I paid for you and that. <laughs> I should be go free. Fucking cops are taking all this shit from black people. Clap if you're black. Clap if you're black. You're not black, bro. You're fucking white as fuck, dog. Bro, you're so bro, you're so fucking white you can walk through TSA at the airport. No, we don't have to check you. Go ahead. Kevin's mad right now. Mm -hmm. This is a fucking fun show. Here's to you guys. And yeah. nothing better than being a comedian and being at your house at like an hour after your show's over. I'm, yeah, I don't, I don't have a girlfriend. I don't even have a dog anymore. And my kids don't want to talk to me. And my daughter, she's fucking smoking hot. I hate that shit. You know what I'm saying? If you're a dad, why the fuck you want a hot daughter? You want an ugly, creepy bitch. My sister was hot when we were growing up. Fucking smoking hot. She had legs. She had a nickname, Dink Dimples. She got pregnant when she was like fucking eight. When she went to high school with her daughter. Where's your mom at? Oh, mom got detention. I got to wait for her. I 
I'm not saying she's not still hot, but I'm just saying I don't want to deal with those kind of fucking problems. And our fucking dad, oh my God. Can I tell that story? Is that all right? Can I tell it? When you got your period at the Dodger game? It was mom day. She was going to a Tupperware party. So my mom told my dad, and the most, the most repeated phrase in our house was, really, Joe? Really? Really? Really, Joe? My mom's name is Laura, and my dad's name is Joe. And then she would always say, really, Joe? Really? I'll give you an example. We woke up Christmas morning one time. There was two half-put-together bikes and a bunch of beer cans empty. <laughs> really, Joe? Really? Really, Joe? Looks like Santa got a little bit lit. <laughs> and my sister believed in Santa like all her life. You know, you know what? And then the boxes from the store are outside. You didn't even put them by the trash cans, Dad. <laughs> yeah, Santa slipped up. Huh? Really, Joe? Really, Joe? Really? <laughs> and I'm all, he didn't eat the, the cookies and the milk that we left him out. Oh, yeah, uh, it would have killed his buzz. Really, Joe? That's our dad. So she got her pregnant. She got her fucking period at the fucking Dodger game when it was on Joe's watch. And my dad stutters. You know how my dad stutters when he like when he gets mad about something. You didn't exactly the way he talks. You you didn't. So we're at the Dodger game, right? And I'm the biggest Dodger fan on the fucking planet. You guys are cool. They don't matter. We don't own the team. So fucking I look over and my, my sister's whispering in my dad's ear. We got to go. We got to go. It's bases loaded and Ron stays up. Yeah, I just aged my fucking self. The penguins up. Bases loaded. Third inning. We got to go. Hey, uh, the dad, Ron stays up. Get the, get the fuck over here. Dragging me. Remember before CPS? When you can drag your kid up the fucking stairs. There I am getting scrapes and shit. Looks like I fell in a turbine. We go to the information booth. Yeah, my daughter's giving one of those things. You know, the woman thing. I have no idea. I'm seven years old. I have no clue what's going on. What do you mean woman thing, sir? Yeah, you know. Yeah, you got to know. Woman thing. And she's all, Dad, calm down. No, I, I'm, I'm calm, calm. <laughs> Dad, you're stuttering. You stutter when you're mad. I'm not stuttering. I'm just, I'm just thinking out my thought process. <laughs> and this lady goes, are you, are you, I'll take care of you. And then she grabs her hand, grabs my sister's hand, and walks her in the bathroom. And where are you going, my fucking daughter? Hey, 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 I don't know that bitch. <laughs> and I'm standing there because the bases are loaded and Ron Say was up. She comes out and they had like you know, they have quarters that you put the quarters in, you get the little the woman things. You can give her the woman thing. And she walks out with that lady. They they have no more. Why? What, what's going on? And I'm like, Dad, Ron stays up, bases are loaded. He's like, I got one kid bleeding. You want to make it two? I'll fuck you up. So now I got to add this insert into this story. Our neighbor, you remember fucking the Argentinian family that lived next door? And the fucking, the son got stabbed. So I was outside playing in the front yard when he got stabbed. He's like, they stuck me. They stuck me. I'm like, what happened to you? They stuck me. They stabbed him, right? So now I hear my sister's bleeding. So now I'm mad. You want to hey, have one kid bleeding? You want to make it two? You're bleeding? Who stuck you? <laughs> so now I'm mad at eight years old. So the lady comes back with a fucking thing and they put it in fucking her period and they, they stopped the flu. <laughs> so we left at the fifth inning. And Ron Say was up, bases loaded. He gives her 10 bucks. He was like, yeah, 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 yeah. he kind of had a bad day. He'll go get a souvenir. Where's mine? No, she had a bad day. Well, so did you. You didn't find who who stuck her.
So he calls on the, on, on the payphone at Dodger Stadium. Lori, yeah, yeah. Good idea that uh, you go to the Tupperware party today. Yeah, real good idea, huh? That's all I heard. Really, Joe? Really, Joe? What? No, I'm a comedian. Now I am. I was in an eight. Shut the fuck up. Everybody knows you shop at Kohl's. Calm down, bro. Bro, would you fucking... Oh, you get him. You're talking shit. I'm having a good time with you guys. Liz, you okay? You okay, Liz? All right. Love my sister. We fucking have... We grew up in a fucking era that we don't even know no more, huh? My son, I bought him a Wii, right? True story. I bought him a Wii. He's like, Dad, when you grew up, did you have a Wii? <laughs> fucking Wii. I had a fucking us, me and your Aunt Liz. <laughs> when she didn't want to kick it, I had a me. We used to throw a pillow in a closet and play, and we put grapes around the house playing Pac-Man. The pillow was a quarter. And she would chase me, and I would grab a fucking grape and I'd eat it, and I would chase her. And she would count down six, five, four. If I didn't catch her by one, fucking she'd chase me. And then I had to find another pillow for the fucking quarter. These kids are so fucking spoiled now, huh? Spoil my fucking kids, man. I'm, I don't want to. My son's on his third car. Yeah, we bought him three cars. He crashed all of them. Yeah, a little fuck. Next one I buy him is a bus pass. Hey, I can hear you when you talk. Okay, don't distract me, all right? Because there's a lot more people here than just you two. See, I can hear you too, sir. Calm down, all right? He looks like the Cholo's accountant. He has a fucking goatee and bald hair with glasses. Hey, Sleepy. You used way too many bullets last week, eh? I told you eight bullets a week, homie. Are the bills coming out? That's what's happening right now. The bills are coming out. I hate when the bills come out. That's where all the Mexicans and blacks stop laughing. <laughs> I'm serious. Like, right, like, what's going on right here? Look at They're talking right in front of me. Shut the fuck up, sir. Dude, use sign language. Mexican get a bill. What the fuck? What the fuck? <laughs> fuck, it's expensive here, eh? I could have fixed our faucet. Black people are the loudest. What the fuck? Nigga, I didn't order tax. Who the fuck put tax on my shit? And the Asians like Kevin go, oh, we don't even care. We own a Tustin and Rancho Margarita. Is that your wife or what? That's your wife right here? That's why she's mad dogging me whenever I mention your name? <laughs> I'm still going to take a picture of you, bro. I know, I'm going to take a picture of him. I'm going to put you on YouTube, bro. You'll be famous. Each of my videos get like 100,000 views. If I knew how to... You, well, hold on. There, I know. If you do this... Oh, let's do a video. Let's do a video. Fuck yeah. Okay, hold on. Hold on. Hold on. Shh, shh, shh. I'll tell you when it starts, right? And say, Kevin. Okay. Now. What's your wife's name? Afi. What? Afi. Afi? <laughs> Afi? Afi? Her name is Afi? Really? Afi. Afi. Okay. Did she tell you that the first time you had sex? <laughs> I want Afi! <laughs> Fucking blast here. I'm moving to Irvine. I'll just take the John Wayne Airport, you know, kick it. 
Anything you guys want to talk about? Because I make it up as I go along. So, Liz, you cool? What do you want to talk about? Oh, t- you know what I want to talk about, Liz? For you, right? We're filming this tonight, all right? Our cousin Alicia. Because she grew up here in America, but she married some guy and she moved to England. Now she talks like this. <laughs> right? Hello there. Oh, I woke up and my son had rashes. <laughs> yeah, she grew up here. She's Filipino and white, right? How long has she been there? How long has she been there, babe? I got, my son had rashes. I couldn't even get out of the car. I put the car in the garage. What's a garage? A gar- 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 garage. You know where you put the car? Garage? The garage. <laughs> Fucking trip. You, you don't understand. I grew up with her. So to see her talk like that is weird, huh? I don't understand what's going on with the O.J. Simpson. Our O.J. Simpson? We don't claim him. No, your O.J. Simpson wanted to move to England. You know he tried to do that, right? You didn't hear about that? He tried to move to, to England because he was sick of everybody talking shit to him at restaurants. I'm like, he moved there, they talked the most shit ever. Hey, O.J., you kill her? <laughs> nah, I didn't kill nobody. You're a bloody lawyer! I fucking met him one time at Miami. This is a true story. I met him in Miami, and he fucking, like, he walked up to me after I went on stage. So he was a VIP section right there at the club, and he was there with, like, three other white chicks. I'm like, mmm. He <laughs> might have picked wrong on Tinder. <laughs> so he walked up to me when I got off. I was opening up for John, Tommy Davidson. I don't know if you know who he is from Living Color and shit. He's an awesome cat. But uh, I opened up for him, and I got off stage. Out. He's like, oh, man, you killed. I said, so did you. <laughs> True fucking story. So I called my ex-wife, Lisa, right? Remember, yeah. Can't talk shit because it's on YouTube. I, I go, Get, you don't believe who I met. I'm in Miami, right? She's out. Gloria Estefan. I'm all, no, I'm just hanging with O.J. Simpson. She's like, ew. <laughs> Did you shake his hand? Fuck yeah. Why? He killed two people. Bitch, we're from Puente. <laughs> We've hung with people that killed way more than two people. <laughs> you handed them beers, bitch. Fucking rich. You okay, man? You want some beer? You want a beer, bro? What? What do you What do you have? You want a shot, bro? Who's driving? Fucking, you bought her a brand new car. Fucking, you can take a shot. I'll take one with you. What do you want? What do you want, man? What? A what? Fireball? Fuck yeah. Oh, my God. Liz, you're getting in the ass tonight. I want video, Rich. Because she's been putting in my ass for fucking 35 fucking years. <laughs> Can I have a shot of Fireball? I'll take a shot of vodka, too. We're going to get fucked up tonight. We're fucking, it's Irvine. Be careful, right? Hey, Kevin, you're fine. You'll drive. <laughs> Cops up. Boop. He's Asian. He's supposed to drive like that. <laughs> I teach your children, asshole. <laughs> 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 Can I have a shot of vodka and a shot of fireball, please? No, I'm going to take care of that for you. After hours at Rosa's. After hours. Hell yeah, we're going to be all, we're going to be fucked up. I'm going to be smacked back. I don't have to work till next Wednesday. <laughs> My sister hates me, but I hate her right back. She works for the state. She works for the prison system. What do you do, babe? What do you do? Records analyst. So if somebody gets busted and they're in their prison, she goes, he ain't getting out for a long fucking time. <laughs> she gets every fucking holiday off. Hey, why don't you at work, babe? Arbor Day. <laughs> no, it's okay. You distracted me. Go ahead and finish your conversation. <laughs> like there's not a show going on right here. 
I'm really here. Do you want to touch me? I fucking haven't had sex in like four weeks. <laughs> fucking my dick, like, like literally when I'm taking, thank you, brother. And can you got, you got his right there? Raise your hand, Rich. Raise your hand, Rich. Thank you, brother. Yeah, uh, like my dick looked at me and goes, just don't even touch me because you don't care about me. <laughs> it changed, my dick changed our fucking Facebook to status to fucking complicated. Kevin, I can't even find my dick. <laughs> hit him! Hit him! Hit him! <laughs> right there, you got it, bro? Or what? All right, here you go, man. Here's my brother in law, Rich, for taking care of my only sister. You don't understand, bro. You are completely appreciated, man. I love you to death, man. You're a sexy fucking whore. You look like an overweight Clark Kent. No, it's cool. I got fucking uh, 10 minutes left. We good? Oh, say one minute left? One minute? You guys want me to go on or what? I got to hear it. If you want me to go on, I'll work later for you guys. We're like 20 tickets sold out in fucking Orange County. Weird, huh? The cops are outside going, they haven't left yet. All right, I'll make you guys a deal, all right? Because I'm supposed to get off right now. My contract says 35 minutes. Look in the back right there. You see that fucking clock? 35 minutes. It's 33 or 35? 36. So I've already went over time a minute. I'll do another 10 minutes if you guys raise up $1 for the witch staff. Because the longer I go, the longer they have to work, all right? Is that fair? And I'll start off. I'll give the first 100. How's that? Raise them up. Raise them up. I want to see him. Wait, staff. Wait, staff. Come here. Wait, staff. Wait, staff. Come out here. Hey, Mike, take care of that. Raise them up. I want to see the fucking ones. The ones. You got 20? Fuck yeah. Raise them up. Raise them up. Yes, for everybody in the table. Raise them up. I'll do another 10 minutes, and I'll do my fucking power shit for you guys. I'm... Raise them up. I want to see them. Wait, staff. Come out here and get it. We got a table right there. Who's on that table? Who's on that table? The, what? No, there you go. Keep it. Go over there, bro. Get it for the week. Hey, if they ain't out here, that's your money, bro. Raise them up. I want to see it till it's gone, all right? Right here. For him, too. For him, too. Right there. Grab it, bro. The fuck? The fuck? You, what are you, a Buddhist? Over here, right there, right next to you, bro. Right there behind you. Right there behind you. And thank them for being a badass staff, because they were quick. Yeah. All right. Thank you, Pat. All right. Your husband's scary, just letting you know. Hey, what you guys want to talk about? What you guys want to talk about? What? What? What do you want to talk about? Yell it out. The Padres? Fuck the Padres. Nah, no mame cabrón, pesoso hediondo. Fuck the Padres, bro. They're named after priests, bro. They haven't won a fucking World Series ever. Yeah, fuck you back. You smaller Filipino. Kevin, attack. The fuck is your problem, Ramon? Don't stand up like that. I know you dig. You stand up again, bro? Yeah, yeah, Padres. Yeah, everybody's on that bandwagon. Yeah. Yeah, and the Chargers can't sell out a fucking stadium either. Whose house? Thank you. That's what I thought, Ramon. Sit down, bro. I'm not afraid of you, bro. I got a sister and a fucking big, overweight fucking brother-in-law where's he at where'd he go went to take a shit or what you bought him food i told you don't bring him food no shit everywhere <laughs> 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 
drunk stories? Oh, I can give you a whole bunch of those. You ask my sister who my father is, and who our father is. Yes, we have a bunch of drunk stories. My, our father flipped his Corvette, remember? Flipped his Corvette seven times, walked home, and tried to call it fucking stolen. In front of a Circle K with cameras. Me and my sister bought weed and liquor and watched the video over. Ha, ha, ha. Fucking dad tried to say he got stolen. You see him crawl out of the car. And every camera he's seen, he ran from. <laughs> fucking dad, huh? Here's the dad, babe. I'm fucking 74 years old, doesn't give a fuck about shit, huh? Fucking old fuck. I love him to death. <laughs> My father, all he cares about is politics, huh? Hey, yeah, 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 Obama, black bastard. <laughs> Needs to be struck by lightning. Yes, dad. Um, I just want to know what you want from the hat. <laughs> Boy, I want an Obama special. I want it burnt. <laughs> and we fuck with him, huh, babe? We fuck with him. Uh, um, uh, her niece is pregnant. Hey, we should name him Bill Clinton Garcia. <laughs> wait, 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 what? <laughs> what the fuck up, dad? Robin Williams story? Which one? No, oh, fucking Narnia. <laughs> He's in Texas right now. Narnia's. In... Hey, man, me, bro. I heard you're going to be in Irvine, dude. Hey, man, I want to go out to Irvine. I heard there's like a hot white girl there. I'm like, you like black girls. I know, man, but it's funny, man. Just to tell a fucking black girl you fucked a white girl, they don't like that. <laughs> okay, hold on. What the fuck? This turned into Jerry Springer real quick, like. <laughs> well, the last bill was paid or what? Did she tip you good or what? Hey, babe, babe, waitress, waitress person walking in front of me. Did she tip you good? Check it out, because I'll put her on blast right fucking now. <laughs> what? <laughs> I know my son looks exactly like me. If I went to Maury, fucking be like, get out of here, Dick. You're the father. Hold on, my boy Brick right here. He's in the crowd right now, asshole. Okay. Um, can you hear me? Yes, I can fucking hear you. You're here. Why are you calling me? Are you in the green room right now? What the fuck? Bye, dick. Mm, fucking dude. My bodyguard for like fucking 20 years. He talked me into shooting up somebody's house with his gun. That's how drunk I was. Ba 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 ba. Fucking shoot up a house, dog. You got street cred. I'm like, yeah, I do. We get to my house, he's all pee on your hands because you got to get rid of the residue. You might have hit somebody. That's murder. That's 25 years. Your sister can fix it. You didn't get that one, Tim? Fuck you. See? Now I'm over like nine minutes. Politic what? The, the what? The spam? Oh, you want to hear that one? All right. This is a new joke I just wrote. He wants to hear it. The guy standing up interrupting the whole show. I have a homeboy. He cheats on his wife, right? Like crazy. He's been doing this since I know. I know him since like nine years old. He's so smart, he's never gotten caught. So he has this chick he's fucking, and he put her name under spam risk. So it comes up spam risk. Why are they trying to sell me shit all the time? Here's another chick he put unknown caller. Here's another chick he put no caller ID. It comes up like that. So we finally got busted, bro. He finally got busted. Because no caller ID sent him a text. 
Hey, thank you very much. I'm Jeff Garcia. You have a good night. <laughs>